This is step two of solving the Meffert's Volcano Puzzle. If you haven't learned step one yet, please click the link in the description below this video to be taken to the step where you solve these three pieces on every side. What this step is going to be is solving all of these tip sections. These three pieces, these three pieces, these three, and these three. And when we're done with that, we will have everything solved except these edge pieces. So what you're going to want to do is choose any of the four tips you want. I'm going to choose this one right here just because that's the first one I see. So now you're going to check what three colors are there. These three tip pieces are going to have green, blue, and yellow. So then you need to find all three of the tip pieces with green, blue, and yellow. So I already have one of them on this correct side, and that's nice, which means all I have to do is put the other two here. So what you can do is the three colors, again, are green, yellow, blue. So this is one of them right here. So what you want to do, it doesn't matter which position you put them in just yet. You bring one of the tips down from that side that didn't have the piece you want, put the tip onto that side, and then bring it back up. As you can see, now I have green, blue, yellow tip piece right here. Now we scan the cube looking for the puzzle, sorry, looking for the other one, and it happens to be right here. So now is when you have to figure out where does this piece go. As you can tell from these two, these two are next to each other properly, meaning these colors match up. So what that means is that the remaining tip piece goes right here. So what you want to do is move the tip piece place right here, and then you're going to want to bring it down, put the other piece in there, and bring it back. So you bring it down, put the correct tip piece there, and bring it back. So now that tip is all done, and you can tell that it is because all three of the colors from every side look correct. So then you can turn the tip to there so it matches up with these other pieces, and now you're done with that tip. You also should have all of these pieces here still correctly matching their face because when you're solving this tip, you do not want to turn it and have it solved here, but not have these correct. So now you're gonna move on to another tip section. I'm gonna go on to this one because it's the first one I see. So now the colors on this tip, very similar to the last one, are going to be green, orange, and blue. So now I need to look for all tips with green, orange, and blue. In this case, there are none on this side. That's actually a lie, there is one. There is a green, orange, blue piece right here. And if you turn it, that piece goes right there and matches up correctly. So now you need to look on the remaining two tip sections and find the other two pieces that go next to this one. So green, orange, blue. We're gonna go over here and we see a green, orange, blue piece right here. So again, you're not gonna worry about it. You're not gonna turn either any of these three because you're trying to work with this piece. So normally, you'd want to bring this down, put the piece in there, and bring it back. Unfortunately, this piece on the correct tip already is in the way. All you have to do is turn it out of the way there, bring the side down, grab the piece, and bring it back. So now you have these two. And now you're going to look for the last one, green, orange, blue, and it's actually on this tip right here. So then you have to figure out the orientation of these two. As you can tell, it's not correct. From both sides, they do not match up, which means you're going to use the remaining tip piece to push one of these out of the way and then bring it back so it's all solved. So this piece needs to go here. So you're going to bring it down, see how they match up, move it out of the way, and then bring it back. So now you have all three tip pieces together on the correct side. And then you turn the tip and now they all match up. And as you can tell, I did not need to disturb these at all. So now I have two tip pieces completely done. And again, similar to the first step, the last step is very simple. Sometimes your tips will already be solved. Generally not, but sometimes you can get lucky. So this tip right here has green, yellow, orange. So since two of these are already there, I just need to find the last one and put it here. So the last one is this piece right here. So I'm just gonna bring the tip up, put the green, yellow, orange tip here, and bring it back down. And now this tip is solved. And as if by magic, the last tip is solved. 
And again, like the first step, you cannot switch two tip pieces, just like you couldn't switch two of these, which makes solving the puzzle quite a bit easier. So please click on the volcano or on the link in the description to be taken to step three, where we pair up four of the six edge pieces.